but let's get real. You are being selfish, as all human beings are selfish. Hitler was selfish. Serial killers are selfish. And you, my dear, are a selfish Nazi serial killing scumbag. But with your vagina rather than gas chambers or knives. Yes, I just compared your vagina to a gas chamber, but can't we work this out? Here, this will make you... My erections are like Obama's approval rating. Hard to maintain every month because of terrible performance under pressure. Right? Yeah! Right! That was a stand-up joke. I'm sure right now you're considering having sex with me or young Timothy, as most women and some of the men here are doing as well. Well, let me ruin the mystery and tell you exactly what is going to go down. I'm sure you're looking at me and thinking to yourself, this dude is awesome at sex. So that's a common thing girls think. Unfortunately for you, I am not. You think with as many times I've done it, I would have mastered the female orgasm? Fuck that. <laughs> to be fair, you're not as bad as the girlfriend I have who cheated on me every time a holiday would happen. I got her a nice sweater for Christmas. She got me someone else's penis inside of her. There is no gift receipt for that. I will cling to the last thing I have in common with my homosexual brethren. Being able to come up with awesome insults for women's bodies and personalities. Like this. That woman smelled like full court basketball. Or, tell that beastly horse-faced woman to shut the fuck up. Those are just a few. Maybe Tim and I will run away together and get a nice little house in the country and become the premier gay folk duo the world has been waiting for. No? All right. I tried. I guess I'll just stick with women. <laughs> and their terrible, destructive black hearts. <laughs> Is this still applicable to stand-up comedy? No! <laughs> All right, so everyone knows the last three people I had sex with. If anyone would like to sign up, there's a sign-up sheet over. And uh, if you'd like to hate yourself and probably watch me watch a bunch of episodes of CSI while I jerk off, you're more than welcome. So unless you're looking forward to questioning your life choices and having another thing to bitch about to your stupid fucking friends, I suggest you move on, beautiful drunk lady. I will only let you down and come on your hair. Yeah! Love, Ian. Girls hate it when you do that. Like they have great hair. <laughs> is it your hair on your face? She'd rather Where the hair fuck than is your face. hair? Oh Holy shit. I've actually always felt the same way. I'm more into hair than face. When people come in my hair, I consider it a blessing because at least they're paying attention to me. An open letter to every girl who has ever rejected me. Oh. No, it's not sad. It's good. Oh, hey. It's uplifting, like the movie Rudy. Yay. Dear girls, some of you got fatter, some of you got uglier, but you're all older. I am too, but besides sleeping with younger and hotter girls, this is what I do now. Ladies and gentlemen, Tim Kasher. Ah, Everyone buy his new solo album when it comes out. It's a delight. Thank you. This is most of the tracks on it, so you got a sneak preview. Yay! Uh, and if you download it illegally, we will come to your house and fuck your computer. Yay! Good night, you jerks! <laughs> <laughs>